Hi, and welcome to the Holly C Podcast, a show about expressing your brilliance with ease and flow. I'll show you how to take the woo-woo out of the clouds and apply it to real life for effortless action. This show is for world changers and future world changers. So if you know there's more to life and you're wondering what's next, this is your show. Hi, I'm Holly, your host. I'm a speaker, author, teacher of health, wellness, vitality, and spirituality, and also a dragon spirit guide. In today's episode, I wanted to share with you a dragon spirit meditation that I recorded for some students in my Soul Business Fundamentals program. This was a particularly poignant message, and that's why I wanted to share it with you, my podcast listeners. It's a very important message from the universe, a reminder to do something that's very easy to forget to do. Intellectually, we know to do this. Intellectually, we know to do this. But in practicality, in reality, we often forget. So here's the recording from the Dragon Spirit Meditation. So to enter the Dragon Spirit space, place your hand on your heart. And we're going to enter with three dragon breaths. You're going to breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. So let's begin. Breathe in through your nose. And out. And again, in through your nose. And out. And once more, in through your nose. And out. Hmm. A very interesting message, which is listen to your heart more. You think you're listening to your heart, but mm, just even look back over the past 24 hours and see where you were actually acting from your head, thinking too much, making decisions based on your mind versus your heart. Breathe in through your nose. Easy, relaxed breath out. Ah, awareness of your heart. Feeling love for your heart. Mm. Feeling love for your heart. And be honest with yourself. When were you making decisions from your head? Maybe it was deciding what to eat for dinner. Mm. What time to go to bed? Mm, whether to brush your teeth right after lunch mm, or to possibly wait because you might have a cup of tea. Breathe in through your nose and breathe out. Mm. What about business decisions? Mm, did you decide from your heart or your head? Now, we are not telling you this to uh, denigrate you and say, hey, look, you're ignoring your heart. We're just pointing this out to show you how easy it is to slip back into the habit of mm, choosing from your head as opposed to your heart. How much joy have you been feeling lately? How much stress? How much worry? Those are indicators of how you are choosing. More joy, more choices from the heart more stress and worry, more choices from the head. How has your body been feeling lately? Have you been feeling ease and flow? Choices from the heart, choices made with joy. Have you been feeling struggle, discomfort? More choices from the head. Remember, your body is a reflection of what is going on inside you. If you have been feeling joy, ease, flow in your body, you have been choosing with joy, ease, and flow. If you have been feeling mm, harder to get up in the morning, a little bit stiffer, mm, tired, not like yourself, then you have not been choosing from your true self, your authentic self, your place of joy, from your heart. Breathe in through your nose. And release. So how can you choose from your heart more? Well, first, honor 
respect, love, feel, connect with your heart. It's hard to make choices when the heart's voice is silent. And if you're tuned in, hmm, if you're listening, if you're feeling, if you're appreciating, if you're looking, if you're seeing, if you're hearing, you're there in the moment with your heart. It's telling you something right now, something to choose, a choice made from joy. And we are going to keep this meditation short because this may be one you want to refer to again and again. Whenever you are feeling struggle, whenever you're feeling lack of movement, whenever you're feeling blocked, even if you're feeling physically unwell, Listen to this meditation again and remember, remember your heart's song. And listen, and things will turn around very quickly. And on that note, we will exit the dragon spirit space. This has been a short free flow by design. So breathe in through your nose, hand on your heart, and breathe out. Ah. And again, in through your nose. And breathe out. Ah. And once more, in through your nose. And out through your mouth. Ah. Hello, welcome back to our podcast. And the universe is giving me a simple phrase to remind you how you can always keep this message close to your heart. And the reminder is to remember your heart's song. And if you feel into the energy of that, you can feel there's like an energy vibration. There's like music that your heart makes through the energy. And that is your heart's song. So listen and follow your heart's song. And on that note, we are at the end of this episode. Thank you so much for listening. A new episode of the Holly C Show, Express Your Brilliance with Ease and Flow, is released every Monday morning until we get to episode 84. And then I'm following my heart song and the guidance from the universe, which is basically it's time to conclude this podcast for now. And it may take a different shape or form in the future. Right now, I don't know yet. I'm just waiting for guidance from the universe. All I know is that episode 84 will be the last episode of this incarnation of the Holly C Show. You can find every episode on my website at www.hollyc.com. And while you're there, you might want to sign up for my weekly wisdom newsletter. That I am getting guidance to continue. So what I do is at the start of the week, I tune in to Dragon Spirit for a message from the universe to share with you, to guide and support you for the week. Next week, there will be a new podcast episode. So I look forward to reconnecting with you again soon. Bye for now. Thank mm-hmm. you.